Could Xpeng's stock be on the verge of a major breakthrough? Despite hitting a record loss, there's a new player in town that's turbocharging sales and giving Tesla's Model Y a run for its money. Stay tuned to find out the potential price target for Xpeng's stock. Okay, let's dive into the news. Chinese EV giant Xpeng Motors recently unveiled its Q2 earnings. The numbers? A mix of highs and lows. On one hand, we see a promising rebound in revenue, but on the other, record losses are casting a shadow. The recently launched Xpeng G6, which many view as a direct competitor to Tesla's Model Y, is already making waves and significantly boosting sales. In the second quarter, Xpeng delivered a whopping 23,205 vehicles. That's a 27.3% increase from the first three months of the year. However, when we compare it to last year, it's a decline of 36%. Now, here's where it gets interesting. After a decline that started in the fourth quarter of 2022, Xpeng's revenue saw a rebound in Q2, climbing 25% QOQ to 5.06 billion renminbi, which is roughly $700,000. But it's still a 31% drop from the previous year. The gross margins? They've dipped into the negatives at minus 3.9%, a stark contrast to the 10.9% from last year and 1.7% from Q1. The vehicle margin also took a hit, dropping to minus 8.6%. So, what led to these numbers? Xpeng's largest loss since its public debut in August 2020 was a staggering 2.80 billion renminbi or $385,000. The EV market in China is fierce, with Xpeng battling giants like BYD, Tesla, NIO, and more. Adding fuel to the fire, Xpeng slashed prices on its most popular EVs earlier this year, a move triggered by Tesla's aggressive price cuts, sparking what many are calling an EV price war. And guess what? Tesla's at it again, slashing prices on its Model Y and Model 3 in China, further intensifying the pressure on rivals like Xpeng. But it's not all doom and gloom. Despite the record losses, Xpeng is betting big on its G6 Coupe SUV to turn the tide. Launched in late June, the G6 is priced between 200,000 renminbi, $28,500, and 276,900 renminbi, $38,000, and boasts an impressive range of up to 469 miles. When you stack it up against the Model Y, which is priced between 263,900 yuan, $36,000, and 349,900 yuan, $48,000, with a range of up to 338 miles, the G6 certainly seems to have carved a niche for itself. Xpeng CEO, He Xiaoping, is optimistic, stating that the G6 success is just the beginning, hinting at more SEPA 2.0 enabled models in the pipeline. Looking ahead, Xpeng's projections are bullish. They expect to deliver between 39,000 and 41,000 vehicles in Q3, a nearly 40% increase. With 11,008 vehicles already delivered in July, they're eyeing deliveries of between 27,992 and 29,992 in the coming two months. And the revenue? Xpeng anticipates a continued upward trend, projecting between 8.5 billion renminbi, 1.17 billion dollars, and 9 billion renminbi, 1.2 billion dollars, in Q3. Now, let's talk numbers and what they mean for traders. We've got some surge signals for the upcoming trading session on August 21st, 2023. On the upside, we're looking at $15.31, $15.64, and $16.19. On the downside, it's $14.43, $13.88, and $13.55. These numbers are crucial. They indicate potential price points that could confirm a directional move for Xpeng stock. If the stock approaches or breaches these levels, it could signify a strong move in that direction. For instance, if the stock moves past $16.19, it could indicate a bullish trend, while dropping below $13.55 might signal a bearish move. 
All right, folks, that wraps up our deep dive into Xplunk's current financial landscape and its potential impact on the stock market. If you found this analysis helpful, do us a favor, hit that like button, and if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel. And hey, drop a subscribe comment below, and we'll do our best to engage with you. Before you go, based on today's discussion, where do you see Xplunk stock heading in the next quarter? Share your thoughts in the comments. Until next time, happy trading!